What in the world happened with that smoker on This Is Us? That is the question. HL spoke exclusively with Chrissy Metz about this final season mystery, what it means for Kate and Toby, and more. First, it was the slow cooker, and now a smoker has caused a myriad of questions amongst This Is Us fans. What we do know is something happened with the big green ex smoker that caused Kate and Toby's marriage to explode. Hollywood Life asked Chrissy Metz about the inevitable smoker moment between Kate, Toby, and Little Jack. We're definitely going to find out what has happened with that doggone smoker, and what it meant to Jack and to Kate and Toby's relationship, Chrissy told Hollywood Life exclusively while discussing her Capital One Auto Navigator partnership. Was that the beginning of the end? Or did something happen? We know something happened. I don't want to get too much away, but we'll definitely find out. We'll have that conclusion. Fans already know that Kate and Toby get divorced, and Kate ends up marrying Philip in the future. While fans are aware of Katobi's endgame, it doesn't lessen the hurt. Hollywood Life asked Chrissy if this is a situation for Kate where she can have two soulmates in her life, Toby and Philip. Related Gallery This is us, photos of Mile of Ventimiglia and more. My personal thoughts and convictions about soulmates is I think you probably could. I think that you can meet someone who will propel you to your actual soulmate, Chrissy said. I think we are all here on this plane of existence to grow, to evolve, to change, and we get to impact each other that way. I think Kate and Toby absolutely did that for each other. They wouldn't be at the places that they were if they weren't together. So that's what's so bittersweet about the relationship is, while they grew, they are growing apart. And that's okay. I think so many times we're taught like, okay, well, this failed. This relationship failed, and it's not a failure if you've grown and you've evolved from it. It's what do you do in your next relationship to honor the previous relationship? It's really hard to see them unraveling, especially because I just love my Chris Sullivan so very much. Now I have a new Chris, Chris Gear. I think it really paints this beautiful picture of two people can really appreciate where they came from and how they helped one another, but that didn't mean that they were supposed to be together forever. Depending on what you believe about soulmates, you might be soulmates, but you might not. Maybe you're supposed to last forever. It just sort of depends on what you subscribe to. In the midst of Kate's highs and lows with her marriage, there's also the Rebecca situation. Rebecca's cognitive impairment is worsening just as her relationship with Kate is reaching a perfect place. That's a huge regret that Kate has, and I think she'll hold that for a while, Chrissy noted. They just were getting really good when she got this diagnosis, and how much time and years and experiences did they miss together because they just weren't always speaking the same language. I think that really catapults Kate to want to spend every single waking moment with her mom in every way that she can and make up for lost time. I think that's why it's really important for her to make the decisions that she's going to ultimately make as it pertains to her relationship with Toby. The actress also opened up about her partnership with Capital One Auto Navigator and why it's so important for her. For me, it provided opportunities, which meant going on auditions, getting me to the place I am right now, talking to you about a show that I happen to love to be on," Chrissy explained. It provides accessibility and opportunities for people, and also the freedom. It's empowering, but it's also a little scary and nerve-wracking to buy a new car. So with Capital One Auto Navigator, it makes it so easy because you get to find your real rate and your monthly payment before you even head to the dealership. So when you get there, it's like you get to test drive the car that you got to choose, and you can find it literally if you want a specific color or make or model. 
It just makes it so easy, and it takes the scaries away because it's overwhelming, especially if you've never done it. If you're in the market for a car, you can literally go to CapitalOne.com slash cars. It's just so easy. I wish I had this when I was younger, 